Have you ever wanted to detect enemy aircraft? Then listen up. Radar has lots of real world uses in sports, transport, astronomy, meteorology, but it was first used to detect enemy aircraft just before the Second World War. And how it works is pretty cool. Radar stands for Radio Detection and Ranging and can be used to detect the position and speed of moving objects. Pulses of electromagnetic waves are sent out from the gun and are reflected off an object and then travel back to the radar. It times how long the waves take to return to calculate how far away an object is. If the object, like this ball, is moving towards the gun, those waves will bounce off the ball and return quicker and quicker as it gets closer to the gun. The frequency of the waves will change. This is called the Doppler effect. A common example of the Doppler effect is the change in noise you hear when an ambulance siren passes or a race car whizzes past. This gun sends out pulses at a frequency of 34.7 gigahertz. That's 34.7 billion wave pulses a second. That means it actually uses microwaves instead of radio waves. These invisible waves of energy travel at the speed of light, almost 300,000 kilometers a second, and bounce off everything and travel back to the receiver which uses the mathematical relationship between the speed of light, the wavelength, and the frequency of the waves to determine its speed. Let's try it out. It's at 100. Seeing that, it's on tape, it's on tape. Tuning forks can be used to calibrate radar guns. As I stroke the tuning fork, the tines vibrate at a specific known frequency, moving back and forth extremely fast, changing the frequency of the waves hitting it from the radar gun. This change corresponds to a certain speed, which the radar gun calculates. Pretty cool. Fancy a game of pool? Well, on this table, I have mathematics on my side. The shape of the table is called an ellipse, and that's the secret of getting the ball in the pocket every time. An ellipse has two important points called the focal points. The hole is located at one of the focal points and the other, well, it's up to me to find out. Because if I place the ball on a focal point, wherever I hit it against the table, anywhere, it will always rebound into the pocket. An ellipse has the mathematical property that from any point on the side, it makes the same angle to each focal point. So if the ball passes through one focal point and hits the ellipse, it will pass through the other focal point or the hole. That's the theory anyway, but this is real world and things like friction, structural properties of the table, and my questionable pool skills all come into play. So let's test it out. Zing. Elliptical mirrors like those used by dentists place a light at one focal point which reflects the light to the other focus, your mouth. This energy wheel is an electric generator. It converts your movement into electrical energy using magnets and wires. As I run on the wheel, coils of wire move through magnetic fields from the magnets inside, creating an electric current. And some gyms around the world are actually hooking up many of their exercise machines to generators to power their lights or even your phone. All right. Don't try that last part at home. An illusion is a distortion of the senses, which can reveal how the human brain normally organizes and interprets information from the senses. They can distort our perception of reality. Illusions can occur with any of the human senses, but visual or optical illusions are some of the best known. I got a cool one to show you now. The gravity room is tilted at 25 degrees, but visual paintings on the wall disguise the tilt. The ears and the eyes both used to help you balance, send conflicting signals to the brain, which results in you losing your balance and feeling dizzy. You can also do cool things like this. Oh, you're home. Oh, some day at work that was. I uh, got the shopping you asked for. Perfect. Um, there was a sale on as well. Things were probably flying off the shelf. My head's... Hope, hope the, the eggs weren't in there. Yeah. Traffic was terrible. Jesus, sit down, make yourself a cup of tea. Sit down, sit down. Oh, you, you put up my picture? Yeah. Jeez, flying off, the years are flying by. Are you okay? Yeah, just my boss was all over me. 
Just need a little sit down. Yeah, sit down, make yourself a seat. Hello? Oh, yeah. Just need to sit down for a few minutes. Work today. This. Oh, oh. It's gonna. Do you need to lie down? Rest for a little bit. Uh, I'll just stay here for the night, dear. You'll never guess who called round earlier. <laughs> 